Hey guys, so I finally got some free time to get back to the 82 GT with T-Tops. Uh, I just got my Cobra transmission back from the shop this week. I did a full rebuild and tonight I got it put in. Um, I painted a few things blue underneath just because I'm going with a black and blue theme on this car. It was black and red originally, which I'm just not a fan of the color red. So, crawl underneath here with me. <clears throat> Always use jack stands, please. I have two in the front and two in the back, as well as my jack. It's not holding anything up, but Harbor Freight did just have a recall on a lot of their jack stands, and I don't know. I never looked to see if mine were in it. So, if one of them fails, my jack's still there to save my life. Please always be safe when you're under a car. <clears throat> now, back to where I was. I've got black tubular control arms, black contributor tubular K member. I did my bell housing blue. The transmission shop painted my transmission, which is a Borg Warner T5 manual five speed out of a 93 Cobra. They used some aluminum colored paint on it, cleaned it up. I did a blue cross member, and then I've got an aluminum drive shaft, and I haven't done anything with the rear differential because I don't know if I'm gonna change it out for an 8.8 .8 or not. Um, one, I'm gonna, once I get my speed sensor here installed, so uh, my transmission is sealed, I'm going to load this up on a trailer and go degrease and pressure wash the undercarriage really good. Uh, then I'm going to spray some fresh undercoating underneath it and then go have the exhaust done. And all I have left is a few gremlins and the wiring as far as hooking up the fuel pump. Uh, make sure I have my timing and everything is set and then hopefully this vehicle will move under its own power again. It's been sitting in the garage while I've been working on other people's stuff, so it's pretty dirty. It needs a bath. Uh, I went with the Explorer manifold, had it bored 30 over, so it's actually a 306 cubic inch engine. Some eBay. Hopefully, there'll be decent headers, power steering pump. I went with a 100 amp alternator, mass airflow, ram air. As with any most people who have a Fox, I have already replaced my cow off of a parts car. Once I get all this done, I'm gonna get it painted. I'm going black and blue. I don't know for sure if I just want blue pinstriping, maybe kind of right here, or if I want to two-tone it blue from here up and then black down with maybe blue pin striping in the trim. Yeah, plenty of ideas. Anyway, I thought it's time to definitely get another video up, so. Thank y'all for watching. Stay safe, keep your head on your shoulders, and keep your gears turning.